Mm. Today I've made an effort. Yeah, we're looking nice. Shout us out. Guys, when you're a content creator, especially like YouTube, you realize you spend so much time indoors creating content. So the wardrobe has got to come out at some point. I'm drinking tea, my sister has sent over to me. This girl is a tea girl. Anywho, I went shopping. <laughs> this is where we went, guys. Hello lovely people, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Caroline for Kalicious Loves. Today we are doing an F and F haul. Here we've got Tesco. F and F is the Tesco clothing line. They sell their stuff in store, but you can also get them online at Next. They, for some reason, don't sell online themselves, but you can get it at Next. So I spent 201 pound 30 pence. We're trying to keep it to like 200 with the shopping hauls and um, if it goes over like maybe by 10 pounds that's cool. So the main objective for this haul is to like show you what I got and how I'm going to style the pieces. Unfortunately I did not get any jewelry or any accessories or any shoes because I just couldn't see what I liked. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then with these next court block heels that I got from my mom. <laughs> the first outfit is this cutout for a dress. I was attracted to the print, but now that I've tried it on, I feel like the cutout is too way up because then you can see my bra. I feel like if the cutout came, you know, down a little bit, that would be nice, okay. <laughs> But yeah, this is the look with my uh, wrist sandals. It's actually a very cute uh, summer look. You can't go wrong with frills. I love it. I love it. You can wear this to the beach on a summer's day, you know, with your rotten bag, your shopping bag, or your crossbody bag. This is the second look. I've got the white bodysuit on and this linen shorts. It's giving skin, it's giving legs. Guys, I'm just having tea, like I've had loads of cups of tea, so bear with me. <laughs> so this is the look. I feel like this is actually a cute look for the barbecue and the beach. You could, it's not wearing a body, so you could just wear like a swimsuit and then, you know, put the shorts on. And then as soon as you get to the beach, <clears throat> take them off. Uh, but I love this look. I love linen for the summer. It's so light and so cool. Definitely a material you should invest in for the summer. This was in a size large, but I feel like it's quite big. It's very elastic, so I could go for a medium because I, I want <clears throat> my bodysuit, you know. So the second option for this bodysuit, I am pairing it with these uh, tailored fuchsia pants. Um, <clears throat> if you have seen my lingerie videos when I talk about visible panty lines. <laughs> the thing, this is, I love bodysuits, but there's a like a love hate relationship because with bodysuits, you are always going to have a visible panty line because the <sighs> the ends of it are so thick, yeah, because it's a top. They're so thick that they're gonna be seen when you wear pants. So when I wear bodysuits with fitted pants, I'm just wearing them because mm, I have to, okay? But it's not like my favorite thing. I usually prefer like thonged bodysuits. That way they won't give me <clears throat> the unnecessary visible panty line. But this is the look. I mean guys, it's summer. You're going into the office. Don't bring some dark colors, yo. Don't bring in some dark colors. You, you've got to come in with the popping colors, you know, brighten up the mood. Sometimes you just need to go in with one hot pink. And then everything's like, ooh, good vibes. But I love this look. 
The pants are fitted, they're not too tight. I think it's the perfect fit. I wouldn't want to go and size up because I feel like they'll be loose at the waist. The waist is actually fitting really well, something that I struggle with. Or is it the tea that I've had? Hmm. So this is the other look. Uh, this is like a set. These are like cargo pants, guys. The material is so thin, you can literally see through it. So, with this, I would recommend pairing it with the Nubian Skin Naked range. That way, you don't have visible panty lines and it matches your skin tone underneath. Because if you decide to go and wear black underwear, we are going to see that it's black. The same thing with the top, it's so thin that you can see the color of your bra. But the color that I have here is also skin tone matching from Provisimo and it's all good, it's all good. But I love it, I'm definitely gonna keep this one. I have a baby shower I am going to very soon and the theme is nude. So I think we can pass nude for this, right? And it's so comfortable. I mean, I would tuck it in, but because it's so light, when I tuck in, you literally see, you literally see the lining of the tucking in, and I absolutely hate that. So what I've done is, I've just put one end in there, and then under, right? And then I'm just tucking it in like that. Simple crochet bini. That is so cute. It absolutely goes well with the, you know, the neutral colors going on here with the set. This was, however, like £12 something. Okay, and I feel like if you can find it elsewhere, cheaper, buy that because I don't know. I don't know if I want to spend that much on something I'm probably going to wear once a year. I mean, for the UK, it's most likely a year because once a year because. This sun be going quickly and then before you know it, we are in winter. If you are a resident in the UK and you are trying to save money on your energy bills, I do understand that the economic climate right now is crazy, things are getting expensive, everything is off the roof. So it might help to consider consolidating all your bills with utility warehouse. So this includes your gas, your electricity, your phone bill, insurance, everything for you and your family so if you want to check it out it's going to be in the description box below yeah i think this is the dress that i anticipated the most and the most disappointing as well because why will everything that i bought in size 14 fit me perfectly even like the 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 tailor pants they fit me perfectly so when i picked this blue embroidery dress the bust is just, it's squeezing the life out of me. I don't understand. I don't understand if and if, why is this size 14 not fitting? Right, look at how pretty it is. Look, and it's not fitting me. I'm really disappointed with this dress because it's so cute. And that means I have to go back to Tesco and you know, hopefully find a size 16. <laughs> so finally, we have got something for the beach. I'm not gonna try it on here because, well, I need to show it to you. I absolutely love color on the beach. I absolutely love it. Find me in pink, find me in red, you know, that kind of thing. But I don't shy away from black either. Definitely white, but it's a risky situation because I feel like once you get into like the water, and if it's like sea water or ocean water, then the white color goes a bit <clears throat> funny. But yeah, I've got this high-waisted uh, bikini pants in size 14. The color is so good, so radiant, perfect for those, you know, holidays. If you're going away on holiday, a bikini is usually one of the must packs, okay? If you're going on a beach holiday. Or just, you know, just plug it in your bag just in case, okay? Even if there's a swimming pool because it's hot out here. At first, I thought it wouldn't fit me. This is also in a size 14, but it actually fit me very perfectly. I love uh, the buckle at the back. So it just goes in like that. Although you can't run in this bikini. There's only one brand who sells bikinis and I know I can run in those bikinis 
and that's brevissimo okay i've got this crochet uh beach dress uh they have one in white but you know me i love a little bit of color blocking i felt like you'd be cute with the red bikini underneath and have this on top and we are ready for the beach so yeah that's it I hope you loved all the pieces that I tried on. They are gorgeous pieces, okay? Apart from some of them not feeling really well, um, I think they do really good uh, pieces. Like when you walk in store, you can tell that, okay, that section is is popping. I love, every time I walk into the Tesco close to, to me, when I see the display, I'm like, mm, okay, I see you FNF, I see you FNF. They're really nice pieces. When it comes to quality, in my opinion, I think they are good because I have had their pair of pants for more than two years now and they've gone through a couple of washes and they're still intact. I absolutely love them. So I wouldn't fault them on quality, but sometimes their sizes I think can be a bit off. And I think that's like normal with most high street shops. Like you can't expect everything to fit you perfectly. I mean, they are made for the masses, not bespoke turning yeah so sometimes you might have to go a size up sometimes you have to go a size down and that's why it's important to make sure that it's fitting you right before you decide to keep the item as for this one it's gonna go back that's why you have your receipt you return anyways that's it from me guys i will see you in my next video bye